I've got an unboxing. I've got an unboxing. I've got an unboxing just for you. I got an unboxing. I've got an unboxing. <laughs> yeah, it's your boy D. Anthony from Break Room Blitz coming back at you, baby. And just got my new collector's core. What is this called? Superhero Showdown, baby. The Marvel Collector's Core. Just got it today. This shit had to get it out there to you guys. Dang, and I do not have any keys. But anyway, uh, if you guys are interested in getting the box, I will put the information down there in the description. But let's get into this uh, unboxing once I get my keys. Ha, look what I found, guys. Thought I was gonna get the keys. Got the screwdriver. So let's just get it in. Crack it open. You know what? I'm a little disappointed. This is the only Marvel shirt I could actually wear. Out of all the things that was useful in the Stan Lee box, the shirt is what I like probably the most. And I can't find it. I'm like, where the heck is this shirt at? And I'm trying to figure out where the camera is. So if my eyes seem to be wondering. It's just because uh, I, 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 I don't know. I'm just missing the lens for some reason. Um, but when you guys, damn, I almost opened it. When you guys get yours, this is what you're going to see. Boom! We got a patch and a pin, a pin, and a patch. Alright, these, oh man, these patches look kind of cool, man. I'm not even a big fan of pin and patches, but these look kind of cool. So, here is the pin, guys. Uh, let's get, see, I'm trying to find the, I can't find the lens. Okay, here we go. That is the pin. We got the, the green and red Hulk. Dope. Collector's core, green and red Hulk. Dope, y'all. Man, I like that a lot. One of my favorites. And then let's take a look at this patch. Take a look at the patch. Take a look at the patch. Boom. You know, I'm not, not really sure if this is more of like um like a rivalry but we got ultron and iron man i don't know i mean i would have probably liked huh actually i can't think of another rival oh maybe like uh mm, no that's more like civil war i was gonna say um uh, iron man and cap but that's more like a civil war special story so maybe not yeah so that's patch of the pen kind of cool i like i like those right there i like those right there all right, let's see what they got for us, y'all. When you open the box again, this is what you're gonna see. Boom! Oh, don't fall. What we got? Got our card. We got our shirt. Oh, man. I'm excited. <laughs> We're gonna go with the shirt first. I know I usually go with the uh, shirt last. But I'm excited about this. And all right, so what your shirt would look like? Boom! I almost hit the camera, didn't I? So we got a pop shirt. I'm okay with pop shirts. Not my favorite, but I'm okay with them. There's some that I really do like. Um, but we got Spider Man, and which one is it? Um, I want to say Green Goblin, but it might be the other one so it's green goblin and i forget the other one's name but doesn't say oh yeah, yeah duh right at the top right at the top gotta read so it's verse goblin i would have liked to say green goblin but it's cool i guess for like keeping everything uh asymmetrical i guess or symmetrical um they just did the green but that's your shirt right there that's cool i'm cool with that um, alright, 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 alright. Is there anything? Oh, we got some other stuff. We got some other stuff. We got some other stuff, guys. I'm, I'm trying not to get to the Big Bang, you know, but uh, there is a Big Bang for sure. Alright, so it looks like we got some of these um, vinyl collectibles. Um, Pint Size Heroes. The Pint Size Heroes. It looks like we got Cap. And that's the back of it. You know, 
I don't know what I think about these pine size heroes, but I got a cap there. Captain America. Yep. So there it is. And let's see what else I got. You know, I, I don't know. I think we're just like trying to go smaller and smaller and smaller to get cuter and cuter and cuter. But I think it's not necessary. It's kind of like, like you remember like the phones? Man, how to get this camera, the lens over here. You remember like when they used to have like the phones and it was like the smaller and smaller and smaller got the cooler it was, but it was just so small that it just wasn't cool anymore? Um, let's see. I actually don't know this guy's name because I, oh, damn. I dropped him, y'all. Dang, you know how you drop something and it's like seen to land like in nowhere? Like you somewhere that you just wouldn't expect it to find? Um, hmm. Where the hell? Oh. <sighs> so, I think it's Red Skull. I mean, that would be like obvious, right? Um, but... Not sure. Does it say on here? Doesn't say. I think it's Red Skull, but I'm not really sure. I didn't watch Captain America. Well, I did watch Captain America 1, but went to sleep. But um, I didn't like it, so I don't remember. I didn't watch the comic book, so I'm not sure. But... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before I show you, before I show you the pop, we got something else at the bottom, at the bottom. We have a Inhumans versus X-Men um, uh, comic book, so that's kind of cool. Inhumans versus X-Men. I guess it's a reprint. It says 001. Um, I'm going to leave it inside the case, just in case it is a reprint, but... Um, yeah, or the plastic, sorry. Plastic. But yeah, so we got that. Now, it's time! What everyone wanted to see, baby. Now, I am a big fan of this. So, we got Daredevil and Bullseye Pops. Um, this is dope. Now, I'm not necessarily a big fan of having the Pops like in a container like this. Because I can't really sell one or the other. Because uh, they don't have its own box. Um, but it is kind of cool. Um, I, I'm just going to open it to show you guys. I'm not a big, like, oh, I'm not going to open it. It's not in pristine condition. It's really not in pristine condition anyway. Because who knows what happens with the packaging. You know, like, these boxes get kicked around. It looks like. But let's take a look. At these babies right here. So we got Bullseye. It's a bobblehead. Has this little uh, Raphael weapon. I don't know what that's called. I'm just called a Raphael weapon. Uh, so that's kind of dope. And then we have. So you just need his own case. Then we have Daredevil jumping in the air with the blades on his doggone wrist, which I've never seen, so that's dope. Man, I like that a lot, man. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. I like that pair, don't you know? I like that pair, don't you know? I like that a lot, guys. I'm excited. This was a good box right here. Now, these boxes, I only pay um, 30 bucks, So it's like $25 plus shipping. It ends up being like 30 bucks a month. And it's every other month. It's not every month. It's every other month. So I, I'm always happy. I have not had a box that I have not been um, happy about or pleased about. Now, I've only been doing this for a short amount of time. But I've liked every single box. So... Let's do some recap real quick. Let's take a look at the card. 
Make sure I didn't get nothing wrong. So, looks like everybody got the same thing. And so here's the cards, things you could have got. Um, so, I mean, they all look the same. All right, so let's see. We got we got our mystery minis. I I really don't know what these are worth. Maybe two ninety nine. Maybe because I have like some of these which are like six ninety nine. So and like and the comparison is like half half the size. So I would say maybe I'm hoping one ninety nine. Now if my pricing is wrong, guys, let me know. But maybe two ninety nine. Then we have our. Our X Men. This is a reprint. Let's see. Wolverine, Saber Two, Face Off in this first ever pop photograph cover. The cover was created by Funko artist Rob Schwartz and Funko graphic artist Daniel Wong. Both Saber Two, Wolverine, were part of Weapon X project. Uh, it doesn't say if it's a reprint or if this is like. I'm sure it's not an original story, uh, but I'm not. I'm not in the comic book, so I don't know. But, <clears throat> yeah. Um, I'm going to give that... This says, this says $6, so we can go with $6. I'm okay with $6. So $6. I was told that... The, I'm going to go online. These pins are like $3. And the patches are uh, like $5. Um, so, let's just do a quick... We got 6 and 6. That's 12. Plus 8. That's 20 bucks already. And then we got our our shirt with the Green Goblin, um, which I always count shirts as ten dollars, um, unless you're buying them from you know like a, what's it called six dollar tees or whatever. You're gonna you're gonna spend ten bucks, so that's thirty dollars. And then we have our wonderful, awesome, lovely, great. Pops here. These are going to be at least $30 right now. $30. There's two of them. Uh, it might be going for $40, but these are going to, this is going to be at least $30. So that's a $60 value of the box, guys. So I put in $25 plus $5 shipping, which is $30, and I got $60 out of this. So I'm happy. If, I, I can tell you right now, I can go online and sell this for $30. I'm not, but you could. So sixty dollars, guys. I, I'm I'm just I'm pleased every time. This X Men box is doing it. Some of the other ones I've been doing, I don't know. Um, uh, but check out those; those are coming soon. So we'll see if you know these boxes. Some of these boxes redeem themselves. Um, but this one right here, this X Men, uh, X Men, <laughs> this Marvel collector score box, guys. It is really proving itself worthy I would have to say so I I like it now I want hey I like pops guys you know so and these things are worth money so to me it was a great box I don't know about you but to me great box so all right guys I'm your boy DeAnthony check out my other videos check out my other unboxings let me know what you think other reviews check out our break room blitz main uh page guys so because you know, we do movie reviews as well. So check that out. Um, all right. I'm your boy, DeAnthony from Break Room Blitz. I'm out. Peace.